Hey, fun fans. Thanks to you, we've reached 1 million views on YouTube. And to help us celebrate 254, the Cheesy Poofs has provided us an awesome t-shirt to give away. All you have to do to be entered is to be a YouTube subscriber and let us know in the comments which team you're from. You can enter once in every YouTube video uploaded through the month of September, so make sure you comment below. Giving you a voice. Making it loud our own way. Welcome, Welcome to, to the fun. fun. First updates now, FRC is produced in partnership with the Blue Alliance. Keep up to date on all live and archive first robotics events and team stats at thebluealliance.com. And by viewers like you. We need your help to keep fun at loud, live, and independent. Help us by visiting our Patreon to pledge your support at patreon.com forward slash first updates now. You can also support fun live on Twitch for a few bucks a month or by linking your Prime account for free and clicking subscribe. There we go. Good evening, everybody. Welcome to the Chessy Champs Fantasy Draft Live Auction Draft here on First Updates Now. Uh, hey, if you're new, uh, by the way, and have not seen a live fantasy draft before, you can, of course, type in exclamation draft rules, and that will show you uh, what's going on for that. However, uh, here's a real quick gist of it, uh, is that uh, all of our teams that are going to be doing the live draft here today have $200 to spend on as many teams as possible. It is a live auction draft. However, the teams are random through the draft. Uh, for this as well. So uh, as you keep in mind that these teams that are playing don't know uh, when the teams are going to be showing up in what order or anything like that at all, uh, which kind of makes it fun of it because who knows, of course, when like 254 is going to show up, if they're going to be the last team in the first team. And um, we know it frustrates our live draft teams, but it makes for a good show. So uh, with that said, uh, live draft rules, by the way, too, for scoring. Uh, we do uh, scoring pretty uh, similar to like single league fancy or uh, single league fancy, whatever it's called off the top of my head. Is that right? Single league fancy first? Single season? Season long. There we go. SL. There we go. Thank you. Uh, I'll be made fun of that, I'm sure, later. Uh, so uh, pretty similar to that. You're going to get district points for qualifications and alliance selections. Uh, no uh, alliance selection points for, for, for the fourth robots or backups. Five points for every playoff match one. Uh, regardless, uh, if you win the series, you just get the five points. Only the robots that are in the match receive the points. Uh, we don't get points for awards because, you know, in fantasy first, I don't know. That seems weird. Uh, and then we might be doing a replacement team. I'm not sure how that's going to work yet if a team drops or not based on a new software for it. Uh, with that said, we do have um, a couple of prizes that we'll be doing uh, during uh, both for our live auction teams and for uh, those who uh, participate in our pick em, which will happen after these prices are set, then you can actually go and draft your own team, see if you can do better than what these live teams do. Uh, and usually it happens that way because you get to see what the prices are ahead of time, but then you get to set uh, your own set of teams. You can pick as many as you want within the $200. Uh, and uh, we'll have the, the link for that, which you can see in chat uh, as well, to tinyrel.com forward slash fun CC 2019. And of course, that will be in our Discord. Uh, too. Uh, so giveaways that we'll go through on uh, here are for our live auction, uh, people, the people that are in the call right now and drafting. Our friends at the thriftybot.com has stepped up with a cool swag pack. Uh, so if you're interested, go check out the thriftybot.com and uh, you'll get uh, uh, some just ridiculously great deals on it. They only have a few items out there, but just ridiculously great deals, especially if you're in your FRC. Uh, make sure you go check them out. Uh, but they're giving away a pair of the uh, flange half-inch hex bearings, the aluminum half-inch hex bore split clamping collar, and the uh, contact bearings as well, too, to one of our winners. Uh, and then for the uh, pick them leak. We'll have an Amazon gift card for that. So very exciting stuff. Can't wait to look forward from it. Uh, we're going to introduce the teams here and just do a run down the line. Uh, if you don't mind people that are in the call uh, for captains, if you can just say uh, who you are, if you're uh, on an FRC or FTC or, uh, team or anything like that, uh, and anything else you want to add. So we'll start. Oh, Discord's muted. Sorry about that. We got that fixed. Sorry. Uh, we, we won't go reback. That's okay. We'll have the introduce the way through. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, and we have Latha studying. What's up? I'm Danny from 2491, and I will be representing Lathe studying tonight. And helping me out here will be the one and only Lathe from 1519, Jeff from 1817, and Haley from 78. All right, and then we have PNW Power. Hi, I'm Josiah. I'm from Team 2990. Uh, help me, helping me today, I have Mick, um, uh, Scouts from 40 or 6443, and Luke. All right, and then we have the Dream Team. 
Hey everybody, my name is Eric Klana from Team 2412, and today I've got uh, Team 107 and Team 5943 helping me out. Sir. Awesome, and rounding up, we have, yep. Yep, it's Nicholas. I'm an alumni of Team ASAP, that's 4646, and currently a free agent. <laughs> All right, sounds good. And, and sorry, we know that the uh, Discord uh, was muted for a little bit there uh, for our audience. Uh, but we also have the Brian Griffins, uh, Eloquence, uh, Hokey Bros, and Instant Regret as well, too, which we'll hear more from a little bit later. Our returning champions from uh, last time are the Brian Griffins, by the way, uh, or Brian's Griffin, right? Is that the way it works? Uh, uh, but they're our returning champs from the IRI draft, so we'll see how they do. Uh, with that said, we're just going to go right into it, everybody, and uh, meet our first team uh, that's going to be up on the draft, and that is going to be team number 5700. That's the Soda Bots coming in. Soda bots are from San Francisco. Winners of the San Francisco Regional 26 14 and 1 in official play this year. And bidding starts. $200 these teams have, by the way, to make their picks. And uh, we'll see how they do with that. It'll be interesting. Up to $5 already. Not not the most powerhouse team to start out with, but Soda, Soda Cyber Dragons. Uh, once again, winners of the San Francisco Regional this year. $8 uh, there for Leith is studying up to nine for eloquence ten dollars for yep you gotta do like a really long one for that i think maybe later that's for when it's a win yes uh eloquence up to thirteen dollars in this draft in three seconds up to 14 by pw power $14 for 5,700 soda bots and sold $14 going to PNW power. That's our first team. Nicely done. Second team on there. Let's get some money going right away. I think they had a disappointing championship, no doubt, but we'll see if this team uh, can take the big suck all the way. Uh, doing well here. It's team number 1619 up a Creek robotics is the next team up on the docket. 1619. Uh, winners Oklahoma Regional, Colorado Regional had an early exit in the quarterfinals at championships. But 1619, a great team nonetheless out of the Colorado area. $20 already in the bids, up to 23 there. Hokey Bros up to 25. Yeah, none of this dollar at a time crap. Like it. Two more. Thank you for Latha studying. 35, 37. For Hokey Bros, $48. That's a quarter of the budget. 49.50, it's climbing up. Any 195, I don't think in this one. And chat, by the way, uh, Hokey Bros outbidding themselves. Uh, 53. Luckily, late uh, for more at 54. Uh, chat, by the way, uh, let us know how you feel about the uh, picks. If you feel uh, that they're a good value, if they're overrated, uh, that's what we want to see in chat. Uh, make sure you give, uh, make sure you give some good feedback on that. Up to 58 dollars with five seconds, 60 dollars. And keep moving up here, 61. A lot of money for 16, 19, great team. Once again, Oklahoma City, Colorado Regional, out in the quarters of the turning division. Did not play at IRI this year, by the way. Uh, and this team, actually, I think they're they're doing two robots, right? Because they have one at Chessy Chance, and then they're doing the, uh, the Frederick Castillo event, I think, is this weekend, too, with the second bot. That's correct. Yeah. That's pretty awesome. They get to participate in both. They're seventy-six dollars. Hokey Bros taking it for seventy-six bucks. That's how we do it. We spend money right away here, guys. Gotta love that. And I'm gonna tell you, I think we're gonna see a lot of money spent compared to some other drafts in this one. It will be uh, quite interesting to see. <laughs> uh, next team has a blue banner this year, but it's a Chairman's Award. However, this team still has performed uh, quite well. So let's take a look at team number thirty-three oh nine, the Friar Bots. 3309 Friar Bots coming up on the gate here. Have a nice looking robot. Saw them compete at the Las Vegas Regional this year. I think they were finalists, if I remember correctly. And here comes bidding for 3309. <laughs> so they played at the uh, Orange County Regional on the semifinals, uh, Los Angeles Regional. Uh, out in four. Wow. That's a crazy a finalist there. Uh, and then finalists at the Las Vegas Regional, Carver Division out in the quarters. Uh, with a couple uh, additional events. Uh, looks like they play as well, too. $29 for Brian Griffins, $30. Going up to 35 already. Somebody likes 3309. <laughs> oh, pre, uh, Eugene is posting in chat. There's a prelim schedule out. 
uh, by the way. So it'll be interesting to see and if that changes the course. Thanks, Eugene. By the way, make sure you check out GoInTheBlueLines.com so you can watch all the events. There's, uh, I think, eight or nine off-season events this weekend. So make sure you're going to the BlueLines.com to watch all those events. Uh, we'll be streaming uh, the Ozark uh, event here on Fun. Of course, Chessy Champs, huge event. A lot of people are going to be watching that too. Uh, so you can watch them all. Watch up to eight. $45 sold to Yep. Yep. Hey, every, time you, every time you get a team, I want you to say that. So, All right. Uh, next team coming up here. Uh, let's see. Team, I think, uh, I, you know, it's funny because I've heard of well and motorcycles has gone in my back area. But winners of the Los Angeles Regional this year. Uh, also, Chairman's Award win. That's team number 868, the Space Cookies. 868 from Mountain View, California. I almost want to say Mountain View, Arkansas, just because I'm used to saying that. Uh, but Space Cookies coming up here. Nice looking robot there. And bidding starts already. Up to $10 for instant regret. $11 for Hokey Bros. Dream Team with 13 Yeah, uh, Chessy Champs, yeah, it will, be on, it will be on Twitch, but just go to the Blue Alliance so you can just watch all the events. That's your best bet. Always go to the Blue Alliance. You guys remember when it used to be like a Red Alliance? A long time ago. They tried to do like a competing thing with TBA. TBA just kept growing bigger and bigger. Three seconds up to $21 there for Hokey Bros and sold for $21. I don't know why Nightbot is saying that, so that's weird. <laughs> we'll fix that in, in just a moment there. But sold for $21. Uh, nicely done there. Hmm. I don't know why Nightbot's saying that. There's nothing on Nightbot uh, that was making me say that. So Nightbot's acting weird, guys. That happens. All right, so, yeah, Matt's schedule was posted, Ola Zola. I think Eugene might be able to post that uh, again. Yeah, Nightbot might be drunk. So, All right, so next team uh, coming up uh, here, we just had 868. Our next team is going to be team number 3218, Panther Robotics, 3218. They're coming out of, uh, man, Bonnie Lake, Booney Lake, Bonnie Lake I'm going to go with. Bonnie Lake here, 23, 21, and 1 overall. And bidding has started up to sixteen dollars already. Some PNW people might know what's going on here. Though the PNW team's not bidding on them. PNW Power, come on. Got to rep, got to rep your area. Got to believe. Uh, we're finalists at the uh, West Valley District event up in PNW. Vote high, says somebody. Yeah, a lot of metal on their bot. Kind of an interesting look, by the way. Uh, and sold, uh, let's look at that again. Sold for $20 uh, to Instant Regret. Hopefully not regretting that, but 20 bucks uh, sold to that. And we'll keep moving on. Next team is team number 498, the Cobra Commanders, 498. I like that name. That's a cool name for a bot. Uh, by the way, uh, winners uh, both at Arizona West and Galileo Division uh, this year, 498, $14 for Dream Team. Up to 19 now. Uh, out on the quarters of the first event, which is San Diego. Played at Arizona North out on the quarters as well. Arizona West, uh, of course, won that. And then Galileo uh, winning with 971 and 179 uh, in their division. Uh, and then two and three on uh, the Einstein Field. $29 up to I'll see if they sell for 30 there. That's Cobra Commanders once again. Up to 31 for Brian Griffins. <laughs> and sold for $31 to the Brian Griffins, picking up their first team with the Cobra Commanders. Next team coming up, one of my favorite team names, I think, out there, and that's team number 5199, Robot Dolphins from Outer Space. You got a bit high for the team name, right? That's the way it works. Robot Dolphins from Outer Space coming up here. Winners of Las Vegas Regional and Ventura Regional. I love the logo, by the way. Let's just take a look at that. Nice. Uh, up to uh, $17, $23 there. Up to $27 for Yup, $31 for PW Power. And up to $32. 
Record plant says looks like 2910's manipulator, but on an elevator. Yeah, possibly. $36 for Lathe. PW pulls it up. Lathe jockeying back and forth. Now, chat, let us know what team are you looking for the most? I mean, a lot of people are going to say 254, but is that really the team you're looking for the most out of? Or is there another team you're like, hey, I'd love to see this team just come up next because I think they could go for good value or this might be a sleeper or something like that. So which which teams are in your mind uh, for this? 44-14 says uh, Connor. Up to $47 for Robot Dolphins. Holy cow. Quarter finalists of the Turing Division. They were ranked number two, though. You know, actually, you know, I remember this team. I was at uh, the Friday night. They went to, there was this cool, like, uh, food court place with this barbecue joint and stuff. And I think I was in line with some people from this team. Uh, so sold the PNW Power fifty dollars quarter of the budget going to PNW Power who picks up their second team with one hundred thirty six dollars left. Uh, what do you guys think? Uh, fifty bucks for fifty one ninety nine. Chat, let us know how you felt about the value. Um, you know, I have a slight feeling that this team might go just for a few bucks higher, not by much. They only have three blue banners this year, though, uh, so we'll see how it worked out. But. With that said, our next team is going to be 254, the Cheesy Poofs, early in the draft. Get your money ready. 254, the Cheesy Poofs. We'll see what they go for. Uh, but, of course, uh, winners on the Turing Division this year, world finalists uh, this year as well, too. Can't wait to see these high bids coming out. Only starting at 25. There we go. Let's start cranking that bid up a bit more. <laughs> None of this buy one stuff here. Come on. $53 for Hokey Bros. Be funny if they just all colluded. They're like, no, we're gonna sell it for twenty bucks. Uh, it's probably one of the earliest uh, two fifty four Kenny win champs. Wow, uh, up to sixty nine dollars there, seventy dollars for PNW Power. <laughs> Will it go over a hundred? I think is the question here. Is it worth half your budget for two fifty four? Great team. We'll see. I think you know some people were talking in chat before. <laughs> just bid two hundred. Probably not a winning strategy on that. Uh, but it could be uh, for quite a bit. Chad, how much do you think they're worth on a $200 budget? How much would you pay uh, for this? Uh, Lathe up to 83 Hokey Bros up to $84. Well, this old heck, we even beat them last year. <laughs> uh, $85 uh, for Lathe. Are they going to sell for $85? Sold for $85 to Lathe. Lathe, how do you feel about spending $85 on that? Or I'm sorry, the team Lathe is studying. How do you feel about that? I got to say, I feel pretty good about it, especially considering the rule change that uh, the HAB ranking point is only awarded for 18 points on the HAB platform. I feel like their suck climb is going to serve them very well in this case. And and also, like, they're just, a, they were incredibly solid at champs this past year. So yeah. I'm feeling good. Yeah, no doubt. Uh, on my ears, sorry, we'll, we'll try to equalize that a little bit. Uh, so I think $85 is pretty good value uh, for something like that. I, I, I thought they'd go for a little bit more uh, on there. So interesting. Uh, what other, uh, if I just put you on the spot there, you mentioned the rule change for the half points. Are there any other, any other major rule changes that the audience should be aware of? Well, there are also some changes to how the rocket ranking point will be awarded, namely that if there are, if two... That if uh, two rockets have like all the scoring locations filled on one level, the ranking point will be awarded. Mm -hmm. So if so, if both rockets have level two of the rocket filled, the ranking point will be awarded. If I recall correctly. Yeah, so it'll be interesting to, to just see the the cool uh, different variations that brings. I think they're they're nice little tweaks to it. Uh, things honestly, I wish I would have saw at IRI. I was a little surprised we didn't really see any tweaks from IRI. So I'm happy to see that Chessy Champs is. Uh, uh, doing that a bit more. Golfer, thank you for the 100 bits, by the way. And we'll make sure we read off everybody who subscribed to you because I know there's a bunch of people and we appreciate that. Uh, and don't forget, you can subscribe for free through Twitch Prime if you appreciate our content. Keep fun, loud, live, and independent uh, for a few bucks a month or through Twitch Prime or our Patreon, patreon.com forward slash first updates now. Uh, speaking about money, I feel like we should spend uh, some more. And uh, let's get a little preview picture of the team uh, that will be up here. You know, they were out in quarterfinals, just like 16-19, uh, out early at the championships, but that's going to be team number 29-10. Uh, 29-10, Jack in the Bot, definitely one of my favorite teams uh, from this year, especially coming to the championships. Uh, I know they were disappointed uh, for their early exit, uh, but a fantastic team nonetheless. 29-10, Jack in the Bot, four, four blue banners this year, uh, winners at Mount Vernon, Sundome, Glacier Peak, and the PNW Championships. 
Uh, you know, IRI out in the quarters as well, too. That was a little uh, disappointing as well. But uh, $60, 65 for late, 69 for Yup. Man, they went, this team is going faster than what Cheesy Poofs are right now. And they might not go for as much, but the amount has gone up uh, really fast. 29.10, yeah, what a great team. A uh, couple of years in a row, too. Cool to see. $70 sold to the Dream Team for 70 bucks, taking their first spot there for $70. Yeah. Not too bad. Good pick up there, Dream Team. Thank you. We'll see. Uh, of course, like I said, though, uh, really exits both at IRI and at uh, Championship. So looking for some redemption uh, there. Uh, and I'll definitely be rooting for uh, Jack and the Bot uh, at this event. <clears throat> uh, next team coming up, I think we got a couple people in, in, in chat that might be happy to hear about this team. Uh, that's going to be team number 604. 604 Quicksilver. Uh, 604, your next robot up for bid. Once again, teams have $200. Uh, 1323, yeah, they're our 41st one coming up. So, uh, 604 and bidding starts $24 immediately there. Uh, Chairman's Award of the San Francisco Regional uh, out in the semis there. Silicon Valley out in the finals. Uh, New Division out in the semifinals. $33 there for, yep. Where is it? Yep. Something like that. $33 once, twice, but 35 there for the Dream Team. Nerve-wracking thing watching Kayla Sykes play. Why it's so nerve-wracking to watch Kayla play? It's got the e got the master ELO rankings for everything. ELO, whatever it's called. Uh, sold thirty-five dollars to the Dream Team, by the way. Cook silver money. There you go. Uh, next team coming up is going to be team number eight forty-six. Funky Monkeys eight forty-six. Do you only got a catch right up on CD or on uh, TBA? Come on, Funky Monkeys. We need a better picture than that. Uh, 846 uh, will be starting in 10 seconds here. Uh, no blue banners this year uh, for the Funky Monkeys with a record of 33-12-2. Still a respectable record for no blue banners, though. And bidding starts. They're up to 20 already for Hokey Bros. <laughs> Funky Monkeys played at the Canadian Pacific Regional. We're ranked second and finalists. Uh, Silicon Valley ranked first and out in the semis. Uh, Newton Division rank six, a good ranking. So if you're looking for some good ranking points, it might be good value for you uh, right there. Uh, out in the semis at the Newton Division, uh, they lost against the 973, 13, 23, 50, 26 Alliance uh, with uh, 842 and 1806. Yeah. $41 there for Instant Regret. And going, going, sold for 41 bucks. Instant regret taking that. And that's our 11th team here in the Chizzy Champs Fantasy Draft. All right, next team coming up is a team coming in from Los Gatos, uh, California. The record is 17-19-0. That's team number 972. 972 is your next team up for bids. That's Iron Claw. So 972, once again, from Los Gatos, 1719 and 0, and bidding starts up to $15 already. Uh, played at the Silicon Valley Regional out in the finals at Silicon Valley, and then Roebling Division did not play in the playoffs, and then also were in the San Francisco Regional, which they were also not in the playoffs. Sold there quickly for $16. I think that's our lowest bid so far for a team. Uh, we'll see how yep. that up. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, it is the lowest bid, right? Yep. All right. Uh, next team coming up here is going to be a team from uh, Arizona, from Tucson, uh, Arizona. I think that's what it is, right? Yeah, Tucson. That's, it looks weird because it looks like Tuscan, you know. Uh, and that's going to be team number 4183, 4183 Bitbuckets. 25, 17, and oh, that's a Bitbuckets. Is that a Woody bot? Holy cow. Bunch of wood on their bot. Nice. Uh, going for $8. Up to 12, 13. Big buckets completed at Arizona North Regional, which they were 9 and 8 out on the semis. Arizona West, 10 and 5 out on the quarters. Hopper Division did not play in the playoffs. <laughs> pretty massive intake they have, by the way. Just want to show that off as the bidding's going. That's a that's pretty, pretty huge intake. Uh, three seconds at $18 and sold for $18. Apparently that's going to be the, the low number of the night there. 
uh, eighteen dollars. Yup. Is that another team for you, Yup? I don't know. Yeah. All right, so Yup now has three teams: uh, Eloquence, Eloquence, whatever. Caleb has uh, two hundred dollars and no teams yet. So interesting to see some teams picking up some early, some not. How about a team with a full triple climb? How do we feel about that? I, I'm feeling good about a triple climb team, uh, and that's going to be team number fifty twenty six. Uh, once again, fifty twenty six. Bring them up on the screen here. That's Iron Panthers fifty twenty six. Iron Panthers there from Burlingame, California, thirty two nineteen and zero. Oh. Winners of the Houston Championship this year, guys. And, of course, the new division as well. I should have said a world champion. I didn't pop my mind right away, unfortunately. Uh, with the robot Mothership. And bidding has begun there. Up to $20 for PNW Power. Uh, let's talk about the other events, though. Central Valley Regional uh, out in the finals. Uh, pretty epic finals against uh, 1323 and 1678. I thought it was cool uh, to see pretty much uh, six robots. It didn't quite get all six up, but it's still pretty neat. Um, I know, Connor, I just I deceived you. That's the way it is. Up to $28, $29 for Hokey Bros. Uh, so, yeah, Silicon Valley and Central Valley, uh, two events that they played in. Cent Silicon Valley, though, man, uh, three and eight. A little rough for a second regional. Uh, and sold for $29. Hokey Bros takes their third team with team at number 5026. That was our 14th team. We're going to move on to our 15th team in this draft, and that's going to be team number 2659. 2659 Robo Warriors. 2659 coming in from Mission Hills, California. Winners of the Los Angeles Regional. 30, 18, and 0 in official play. And we have some uh, additional off seasons uh, with them as well. Uh, so winners of what were they, Los Angeles, right? So Los Angeles North, there we go. Los Angeles North Regional taking it up to $16 there. Uh, also played the Aerospace Valley, which is out in the finals. Noon Division played as a uh, played one match in the uh, Noon Division uh, as well. And then had a uh, off-season event, uh, Wings over Camarillo, uh, which oh, was long ago, was that like a month? Yeah. Um, in this event as well. $22 at the 23 there for PW Power. Chad, how much? I still want 195. I know. Uh, Chad, how much do you think they're uh, going going to go for uh, in this draft? That's once again 26.59. Well, the real answer is going to be 24 dollars. But Chad, we want to hear how much you might spend on that team. But 24 dollars going there to Late the Study, who now has 254 and 26.59. Let's get a team up from the PNW. I think one of the uh, when you think PNW, this is a team, especially uh, back a few years, this, I think always a team that pops in somebody's mind. Maybe it changed a little bit now. Uh, but that is going to be a team that has one blue banner this year for Chairman's Award coming out of Seattle, Washington. That's team number 1983, Skunk Work Robotics. 1983, Skunk Work is currently up for bids. 38, 33, and 1 in official play. Man, you got to love all those matches played at uh, the PNW. So... $18 there, $20 for Leith. Uh, finalists at uh, Mount Vernon District event, uh, Auburn Mountain View, semifinals, Glacier Peak out in the semis. Played at the Idaho Regional as well, uh, which are out in the finals. Uh, PW uh, Championships out in the quarters. Uh, Noon Division out of the finals. Man, so many finals this year for 1983. Uh, $33 for Leith is studying. Buy that for a dollar. And sold thirty-three dollars. I think that's a pretty good, uh, pretty good bargain there, honestly, for nineteen eighty-three. Uh, so late to study and picks them up, uh, but only has fifty-eight dollars left in this draft. I do think this next team might cost just a few more dollars uh, than uh, fifty-three. So late, I don't or fifty-eight. So late, I don't know if you're quite going to be able to pick up this team. But let's talk about the five blue banner team sixteen seventy-eight. Citrus Circuits, 1678 is your next team up on the bid. What an incredible run this year, of course, keeping the streak alive uh, with the uh, Einstein appearances and division wins. Up to 33 already. What did 254 sell for? Let's see if these, they go for more. Forget how much it was. Uh, $58 for late to studying, $60 for instant regret. 65 for PW Power. 
Are you going to go with for 65 that much value? No, $70 for an eloquence. Jose Bobelli says should go for 84. Let's see, 74, 75. Oh, 84 is what, uh, got it. 84 is what, uh, 254 went for. Got it, got it, got it. Thank you. $78. 79. Can we get up to, are they worth? Somebody says they went for 85. We'll check. $79 once, twice, sold. $79. Caleb takes it their first team with that. I got him. There you, yeah, there you go. Uh, it's nicely done on that. Let's uh, let's see how much the 254 is up for. Let's take a look here. Uh, 254, 85 bucks. That's what they went for. All right, we're winding on down. We're on our 18th team. Caleb got a steal is what McLass says uh, in chat. Uh, let's keep spending money. How do we feel about that? Why not? Uh, and let's spend some money with another uh, Einstein uh, appearance team. Uh, you know, just saying they, they might have done pretty well uh, as well, too. Uh, you know, of course, winning uh, multiple events again this year. San Francisco Regional, Utah Regional, and, of course, the Galileo Division. And that's going to be team number 971, Spartan Robotics. 971 is your next team. Told you guys, heavy hitters coming out early in this draft. 971, Spartan Robotics. And the draft opens. $30 immediately for Hokie Bros. Up to 50 already. 51. Yeah, not 973. 971. <laughs> Made me look. I thought I selected the wrong team there for a second. $60. By the way, Eugene, I found my blue light shirt. I'm wearing that. I haven't worn this for a long time. I actually didn't know, didn't know where it was. Uh, Sixty-six dollars for Hokie Bros. Sixty-seven, sixty-eight. Once again, eighty-four is her top bid. If you bid seventy-five, Caleb, Hokie Bros won't be able to up you. Strategy coming in here. If you're Hokie Bros, just bid seventy-four. It, it's see, actually, but Caleb, you should bid seventy-four. It's really what you should bid, because now Caleb, you just wasted a dollar. Or well, is he trying to run him out of money? Well, he might be doing that too. So. <laughs> <laughs> and that might have been the case. Sold for $74. Hokey Pro is four teams and has spent all their money by the 18th team. Uh, so Hokey Pro is, uh, you get them. Right there. Out of money. A little bit of wait time. That's okay. Caleb with the 200 IQ plays right there. Says <laughs> Eugene says baited. Uh, <laughs> all right, we'll, we'll slow it down just a little bit. Definitely not a bad team by any means, but not sure if they're going to uh, quite go for uh, what some of our other teams have here recently. And that is going to be a team that has a record of 32, 12, and 1. That's team number 649, M-Set Fish. Uh, Woody Flowers Finals Award at San Francisco. No other blue banners this year, though. M-Set Fish is your team up for bids. Nice looking bot, though. I like it. And eight dollars is the bid there. San Francisco Regional out in the finals. Silicon Valley Regional out in the semis. Turing Division out in the semis. And up to 31, 32, going back and forth. 33 dollars for you up. 34 for eloquence. I'm just gonna keep bidding and opening by one each time here, huh? <laughs> 38 dollars, 39. I mean, I guess graphic-wise, it looks good. <laughs> Somebody says lost the 254. Yeah, uh, 649 lost the 254 uh, and 971 uh, at the uh, San Francisco Regional. And sold there, $42. M said fish. I slowed down all of a sudden. I thought we were going to go a little bit higher for that. All right, next team, uh, I think will be an interesting team. I uh, Personally, you know, I heard a little bit about this team before championships. We had an opportunity to interview them there, learned a lot more about this uh, team that split from another team, and that's team number 4414. A couple blue banners here, looking good. Uh, interested to see what they do, uh, of course, in their second asterisk year uh, that they have. Uh, but once again, 4414, high tide to your next team. Nice, uh, nice look, by the way, too, for a robot. High tide coming up in the bid. 52, 15, and 0 this year. One Del Mar, one Ventura. Went to the Galileo Division. Unfortunately, out of the quarterfinals. 
uh, but still looked uh, pretty darn good uh, overall. And then uh, won the Wings Over Camarillo uh, off-season event. $47, $48 for Yup. $50. Top underrated team. Yeah, I mean, I agree there. I mean, suddenly it looked really good. It always seems to be out in the quarters at championships, but sometimes that's just how it rolls. And sold $50 out of 200 there going to... Yup. There you go. I got the twins. Oh, yeah. I didn't... Firebots and high tide. There you go. All right, we're going to take a short break here to check in with our team, see how they're feeling about the amounts that they spent. We're going to go, we'll go in reverse, reverse order here since Yup was just on. So, team, Yup, how you feeling? You got 972, 3309, 4183, 4414. I'm pretty happy so far. Uh, spent a bit of money, but have some left to play with. Uh, I do like the twins in Friar Bots and High Tide. I don't know if the uh, High Tide will bring their original or their uh, updated practice bot that mm. has a pass through cargo mechanism. So it'll be interesting either way. And either way, I'm expecting a good performance. Absolutely. $71 uh, left for you, by the way. Dream Team, 95 bucks left. You got 604 and 2910. Yeah, we're pretty happy about who we were able to pick up. We were already overpaying just a little bit. But we're feeling good right now. We realize that we don't have a rocket bot yet, so we're going to be looking at those coming up. All right, you can barely hear you. Just a heads up, we'll move on. Uh, but next one uh, coming up with $136 is uh, PW Power. That's $51.99 and $5,700. Lots of money still left for you, PW Power. Yep, so far. All right, very insightful as always. Uh, next team coming up uh, with $58 left. Latest studying has uh, $254, $1983, and $2659. Overall, I feel really good about my lineup, especially getting the poofs. I feel like I may have been spending a bit too excitedly, but I feel good about the lineup so far. I, pl I totally plan to keep playing the up by one game, by the way, so get hyped for that. <laughs> All right, fair enough. Uh, and next coming up uh, with $97 left is Instant Regret. You have team number 649, 846, and 3218. I'm just glad that I didn't fuck, um, screw up on the funky <laughs> monkey. He meant to say funky. That's what he meant to say. Perfect. All right. Uh, next team up is Hokey Bros. Uh, spent all your money, but you got 971, 1619, 1868, and 5026. Uh, no money left, but how are you, how you feeling about the four teams you got? I feel really good about these teams. I feel like 971 and 1619 are both going to be attractive high picks because they can, they're can they compatible climbs with the small drive base and the, uh, the slide climb. And then 1868 and 326 will be good. Attractive second round picks being smart to have a triple climb or a level three climb. All right, a couple left. Uh, Eloquence here, $121. All you have is 1678, but lots of money left. Yeah, I'm shocked that I got Citrus Circuits. In, in the last draft we did, everyone was paying way more for the, for the super high profile good teams, um, but it, I don't know. It, I had them. I had them worth more than that, and uh, we'll see how they do. But they're a solid. They're a solid pick. So. So let me just ask you. You don't have to say how much you would have paid for two fifty four, but you can say if you want. Would you have spent more in sixteen seventy eight than two fifty four? Yes. Hot takes right there, uh, from Caleb and Ronnie. Dot Brian Griffin's one hundred sixty nine dollars left. You got four ninety eight Cobra Commanders. Yeah, four ninety eight had quite the performance on Einstein, so I'm happy with them, and I've got the most money left, so let's see what happens. A lot of buying power and still half the teams left. Uh, you know, it'd be nice if there was a calculator of how many, how many dollars were left, because I'm going to guess we've easily have spent over half the dollars uh, so far. Had to, right? Yeah, it looks that way. Uh, where it's close. Somebody might be able to calculate that. <coughs> um, excuse me. Uh, all right, we're going uh, to... We, we have spent more than half. Yeah, so it'll be interesting. Of course, some great teams have already gone, but you still got some good ones here. Uh, no particular order. You got, what, uh, uh, 973, 3476, 2046, to name a few, and I'm sure there's going to be a few others uh, that come up here. Uh, but let's start uh, with a team that had a record of 21, 12, and 0 uh, in this draft, or not in the draft, in the year. But coming up in the draft is team number 5818, 5818, Riviera Robotics, coming in from Santa uh, Barbara, California, 21, 12, and 0. And bidding starts uh, on this team. We'll see what they go for. Current high right now, $84. Current low is $18 on teams. 
And we're up to $21 already for Eloquence. Lathe up to $22. <clears throat> so once again, the timer resets. Uh, 10 seconds when somebody bids. Uh, $23 is going. $24, $25. So quick back and forth there. Up to $25. Two seconds. And sold. Uh, Eloquence gets her second team. $25 in 5818. Ribera Robotics. 1197 Torbots is going to be uh, your next team up for bid here. That's 1197, 16, 12, and 1 this year. Coming in from Torrance, California. 1197. They got a better pick than that. Come on. There we go. Come on, teams. You got to have good picks up on TBA. I can't believe there's still some teams that don't. Like, that always, like, I, I know there's some teams who probably don't know what TBA is, but TBA has got to penetrate it like 98% of the market, right? Uh, so 1197. So get your pitchers up there. It's not that hard. Uh, <laughs> it's 2019. Uh, so Torbox 1197 uh, coming up. Can't tell you the benefit of good pitchers. Uh, 1197 Torbots, $12 immediately out of the gate. Uh, so this team out in the semis at the Los Angeles Regional, Las Vegas Regional. I saw them play there out in the semis in three. They were ranked three there. Uh, did not play at championships. Up to $17, $18 to PW Power. See you later, Olazola. Good luck with your team meeting. $23 to the Brian Griffins. Looking for their second team. Soul, Brian Griffins gets their second team there with 1197 Torbots. Still has the most amount of money left, by the way, it's $146. All right, this is our second lowest number team in the draft, this is our next one, and that's team number 115. MVRT, out of Cupertino, California, 21, 11, and 0 in official play this year. No blue banners under their belt. And that's team number once again, 115 coming up. And $15 is the bid there. Sure, that wasn't positioned at all that way. Uh, semifinals of Ventura Regional uh, and then uh, San Francisco Regional out in the semis as well. Uh, also, one of these is awarded at championships, so that's pretty cool. Uh, $18 is the bid. Eloquence, 19 for Brian Griffins, 20. I agree, Record Plan. I think TBA is uh, how t how like first hasn't recognized TBA with some sort of award. By the way, like blows my mind. Like to me, like the the benefit that they have provided the community uh, for, I mean, with volunteers dedicating their time for things, it absolutely blows my mind that they do not get more recognition from first. And like I, I, I'm totally fine with them being like the unofficial thing for that. Like first has their thing. I get that, and maybe they don't want to recognize that there is something out there that's better or something like that, but like to me, TBA is the best resource you can possibly find them first. Uh, $21 sold, PNW Power taking team number 115. Let's stay low with numbers, why not? Uh, next team coming up, team number 696, Circuit Breakers, our second lowest number team left uh, in this draft. Uh, so 696 Circuit Breakers coming out of La, oh man, La Crescenta, is that right? Hopefully. Uh, like Crescenta, California, and their bidding is going to start. $15 to the Dream Team. Haven't heard from the Dream Team in a while there. Eloquence bidding there. 14, 12, and 1 in official play this year. Uh, Los Angeles North out of the quarters. Las Vegas Regional out of the quarters as well. And they played an off-season event uh, at Battleship Blast just a couple weeks ago. $20 for Eloquence. And sold 20 bucks. Eloquence picks up their third team with $76 left. <coughs> Coming up uh, next on the gate 6, 4, 4, 3 AM bot or aim bot. So I think I've been corrected on this before. Oh, this is the flippy bot, isn't it? Pretty sure it is. Uh, right, is this about the flips, guys? Yes, it is. Okay. Um, so yeah, pretty cool, cool, pretty cool bot out there. So six, four, four, three. They're also our highest numbered team at uh, Chelsea Champs. Kind of disappointed not to see. I know it's, I know, I know it's an application thing, but it would have been cool to see at least, at least one rookie. I mean, God, what, what year is this team? Are they a third year team? Or are they only second? Yeah, they're a third year team. So the oldest team at Chelsea Champs is three years old. 
would have been nice to see. Maybe a, maybe a second or first year team. Come on, Chelsea champs, you got to let them in. But I don't know who applied either. I'm sure they can. I'm sure, they can probably back that up with good data. Uh, Forty dollars for the dream team. And 41, last second length comes in at 0.5 seconds left. $43 for the Dream Team. Little bitty more back and forth here. Once again, 64, 43 AM bot. Man, that intake that they had, by the way. I'm showing here, team sold for $44. <laughs> that's, a, that's a pretty uh, pretty big suck intake there. Um, is, is that just for climbing or can they also like pick up hatches that way? I believe that's their primary hatch manipulation. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah, they can they use the suction cups for the for hatches and the climb. We I picked them up because I also noticed they have a great a very favorable quell schedule and I also mentioned the I also mentioned the have level three rule change which sixty four forty three is pretty much built for. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah. As you can see they they got a triple climb at IRI with teams 5511 and 3707. And and they also play some really good defense. So I feel good. Yeah, we'll see how it turns out for you. I'm definitely looking forward to seeing them on how they do. How about a world championship winner here, guys? Uh, three blue banners this year. World champions uh, once again uh, at the Houston Championship. And that's going to be team number 973. Get your money ready, Brian Griffins, 973. And PW Parts for over 100 bucks. Still Dream Team's 95, so a few teams. Instant Regret 97. We'll see what they go for. Here they come. 973, $50 already. Uh, Orange County uh, won it with the Beach Bots. Uh, Sacramento Regional uh, lost against 1323, 1678. That's a tough word to have, but then they, of course, paired with 1323 at Champs. $100 to the Brian Griffins. Holy cow. Are they going to be our most expensive team? They are. Hundred dollars. Only to... one team could have the power to change that. What's that? PNW Power has one hundred and seven. Oh, gotcha. So they're the only ones that could change that. Gotcha, gotcha. So hundred bucks going there. Instant Gret bid ninety seven with all their money too. So that, yeah, definitely going up there. But that's our new high end team. So hundred dollars, chat. What do you think? Hundred dollars, good value for in the draft. Too high? Where are you sitting at, chat? Let us know. Uh, for at uh, Connor says not worth it. We'll see how it works out. Uh, next team has been a world champion in the past. Uh, this year, two blue banners, including a win at the Monterey uh, Bay Regional and a Chairman's Award. Uh, some people say it is worse. Some people say nope in chat. So interesting uh, on that. But we're going to move on to team number 1671, Buchanan Bird Brains. 1671. Winners in 2015, right? Yeah, you should know this. I think they beat, they beat my old team. Uh, 1671, uh, $17 going to Eloquence there. $17, $18. Uh, 25, 19, and 1. Uh, also played Central Valley, which are out in the semis. Won the Monterey Bay, as we mentioned, and then played one match in the quarters in the Hopper Division. Twenty dollars. <throat> uh, first match against nine seventy three at Chelsea. <laughs> here, here's sixteen seventy one schedule. By the way, first match. Let's bring this up here. First match, you're against nine seventy three. Second match against two fifty four and sixteen seventy eight. Uh, and then with nine seventy one, that's not too bad. Those first two matches, though, that's a uh, that's a little rough uh, for a start there for Buchanan Burbrains, but sold to the Dream Team for twenty dollars. Next team is our 28th team in the draft. They are our lowest number team. This is going to be team number 114, Eagle Strike. 114 from Los Altos, California. Eagle Strike. 27, 20, and 1 in this draft. $14 there to Yup. Uh, out in the quarters at Del Mar. Uh, $14. They're going to go once, twice, up to 15. Ventura Regional. Uh, we're finalists, by the way, Galileo Division out in the semis. It's a little bit of playoff experience for them, up to $18, 19 there for Eloquence. <coughs> a little back and forth, all the way up to 21. Yup, thought he was going to take it for 14. But now Eloquence at 21, 23 now, 24. Almost doubling the amount. 
25, 26. Somebody knows something about 114 Eagle Strike. I know their primary pitcher is a cad drawing on TBA. That's about it. Uh, Eloquence outbids themselves. $29. Really wants that team bad. Pro Strats here from Caleb. $30 for PMW. <laughs> like a vulture coming in. 114 is awesome, says Necro Creature. I managed to get their shirts at Houston, and I love it. I love a good shirt too. Not sure if that's not sure if that's the best case for uh, why they're awesome as a robot, but uh, you know, free shirts are always good. <laughs> and sold thirty five dollars. Eloquence takes it, so we went from fourteen uh, to thirty five. But Eloquence, uh, Caleb, you get them for thirty five bucks. Twenty five fifty seven is your next team. That's the Soda Bots. Soda Bots. Twenty five fifty seven. Your next team up on the docket here. 25, 30, and 1 in overall play. I think they're our first team under 500 record, uh, by the way. I was just going to say uh, the way for I'm them. feeling. Uh, Brian Sachs, 135. Thanks for four months of support with that Twitch Prime sub. Appreciate that. Thank you so much. Uh, bidding has started there. $17. Are they going to be our lowest team? Two seconds. One sold. 17 is now our new low. $17 uh, for 25, uh, 57 uh, in this draft. Uh, you know, had uh, chairman's sort of uh, PNW championships uh, and then a rolling division out in the semis. Uh, so a little bit of playoff experience still. 17 bucks going to the Dream Team with their fourth team. Uh, so nobody has more than four right now. Actually, pretty even. Either three or four teams for everybody. That's that's actually pretty crazy. I don't know if I've seen that so even before. Uh, but let's move on. Next team coming up. Another team from the PNW. And that's going to be team number 2930. Sonic Squirrels, Couple Blue Banners, Mount Vernon District, and Glacier Peak District uh, in this event. Uh, one with 2910, of course. Sonic Squirrels. <clears throat> and $25 immediately <coughs> for the Dream Team. Yup, up to $30 already. By the way, we are three quarters of the way through our draft. $35 up to $36 for PNW. This is our 30th team in this draft out of $40. $37 for Instant Regret. <laughs> Instant Regret currently has $97. Second most amount. PNW Power with the most at $107. Both have three teams right now. <laughs> Two seconds. One sold. $38 to PNW Power. Down to $69. That makes uh, Instant Regret now our uh, leading team with money. And there's still a couple good teams coming up here. I mean, they're all good, right? Nah, political statement. Uh, but there's some really great teams uh, still up here. Uh, next team uh, is, I think, one of our other teams, one of our other few teams that has uh, under a 500 record. And that's going to be a team from San Jose, California. No, it's not the Cheesy Poops. It's uh, 1072. 1072 Harker Robotics. Uh, Mick Lass, uh, PNW finally got a PNW team. Yeah, right. About time, PNW. Just saying. And bidding starts for uh, Harker Robotics. Like I like how they just take it, by the way. They don't respond back uh, in the live audience at all. Uh, but $15 here for Harker Robotics. Once again, this is the Chelsea Champs live auction draft. We'll be setting uh, prices that you can then pick uh, your own teams off of your own pick them list uh, that we'll have up uh, hopefully tonight, if not tomorrow morning for sure. And sixteen dollars is our new low for Harker Robotics ten seventy two. Uh, yep. Uh, Suzanne, that with the team. Yep. Uh, taking it. All right. I feel some money being spent here. We don't have a ton of money left uh, from our teams, uh, but I think you know for five blue banners, somebody might be interested in purchasing. Uh, this team from the PNW and from Maple Valley, Washington. That is team number 2046, Bare Metal 2046. What a phenomenal performance from this team this year. Bare Metal uh, looking just fantastic uh, this year. And bidding is going to start. Uh, of course, winners in the Hopper Division, winner at the PNW Championships, even took a Chairman's Award. Uh, so definitely a great team uh, for that. Would have liked to see them at IRI this year. Uh, would have been great, but we'll Smart bid. get to see him at championships. Uh, instant regret. Bids can't be beaten. There you go. 
69 bucks takes it for bare metal. And that's, uh, they still have money left too. Crazy. Uh, so now PW Power is has the most amount of money uh, with $69. Only five banners a week. <laughs> uh, next team coming up, we're on our 33rd out of 40th team, and that's going to be team number 3647, Millennium Falcons. 3647. <clears throat> Excuse me. Millennium Falcons coming up. Three blue banners, uh, all for regional wins, by the way, not too shabby. Uh, ooh, look at this nice photography here. Uh, that they have well, maybe not that one but uh but once again 36.47 uh coming up and bids have start up to 41 dollars already 42 winners del mar san diego and idaho 42 dollars there and at rolling division out of the quarters and 42 dollars sold the team yup <laughs> here we go uh takes their uh it's your sixth team uh, yep, so by far the most. Everybody else is four or three. Uh, and you still got 13 bucks left. So we'll see if you can pick somebody up. Unlikely, but we'll find out. Never know, right? Guys, yep. we've, we've been uh, we've been going for a long time. And sometimes you get a little bit hungry. And that means that you might want to entertain team number 5940, bread. Fill you up a little bit with bread. 5940 out of Redwood City, California. 10, 12, and 0. One of the other teams under 500 record. Might be able to get a little bargain here. 10 at 12 and 0. And here they come. $13 for Yup. Up to 14. Sorry, Yup. Can't get them. $14 eloquence. I feel like Caleb just bid just so you couldn't get it. I don't even know. Like I don't mind. <laughs> and uh, that is our. I no just look. needed <laughs> to drive up the price as much as I could for him. There we go. Uh, $14 sold uh, to Eloquence, taking their fifth team with 5940 bread. <clears throat> On to our 35th team, only six teams remaining here, and that's going to be team number 1710, Rebonics Revolution, out of, uh, man, so Lathi, Olitha, somebody correct me here, out of Kansas. How's that? Uh, once again, 1710, you know, I'd love to show a picture of the robot, but guys, no robot image. Lame. Uh, 1710, Rebonics Revolution, love to see more about your team, you know, nice picture would be great. Uh, but did participate at the Heartland Regional out in the semis and Wisconsin Regional out in the quarters, 14, 12, and 2. Yep, she's just going to keep bidding 13. And uh, Lath is up to 14 because they have $14 left. Eloquence just, of course, will just outbid to outbid at 15. Still a good value. You can get any team for 15. That's not bad. So, And sold $15, Caleb, man. Jeez. That man, is I'm yours. just outbidding these guys that don't have any money. Yeah, right. Oh, the turntables. Yeah. Now he's the low man. <laughs> now you're down to 12. <laughs> oh, how the turntables. Now the table. Now that we know there are unturned tables, we know that the tables have turned. Something like that, right? Oh, there's a turn. There's a phrase from that from Rick and Morty. Uh, all right. I think it might be time uh, for money to be spent. What is our most amount? 69. Uh, so we'll see how much gets spent here, and that's going to be team number. 3476 code orange is now up 3476 let's see what they go for code orange coming up on the docket here 23 22 and 0 not a very impressive record uh, but the robot looks pretty darn good winners winners of the aerospace valley hopper division out of the quarters uh 58 dollars for dream team uh we'll see if pnw decides to outbid and they do not so dream team takes code orange 3476 Dream Team, you're out of money. How do you feel about picking up Code Orange with your last pick? Uh, I think that's that's a great value, honestly. I was I was thinking PNW Power was going to take it, so we're really happy we ended up with that. Yeah, we'll see. It'll be interesting to see who they're waiting for because there's only four teams left. But hey, you know, with all that money, you might be able to just uh, take a couple teams for free. But Brian Griffins does have forty six dollars left as well, too. Uh, so with that said, uh, four teams remaining in this draft, and then afterwards we'll do a quick check in, and then we'll wrap up for the night. Uh, but the next team is going to be with a record of 34, 21, and 1 in official play from the PNW. That's team number 2733, Pig Mice. I've never heard of this team. 2733, I'd uh, love to hear maybe more about them from somebody from the PNW uh, after the bidding's done. Uh, but 2733 is your next team up for bid. And uh, $28, uh, PNW Power uh, bids and outbids themselves for $28. Uh, so we'll be at the Brian Griffins. If they want it, they do not. 
And that is now sold to PW Power. Can, do you, can you guys tell us anything about 2733? Apparently not, PW Power. Way to rep your own region there, just saying. You know? Yeah, they definitely <laughs> had a professive performance. I don't know too much about them, but they were strong this year. All right, that's fair enough. So, All right, 2733 has now gone. That means we're down to our final three teams. Which team are you waiting for? Let's see. PW and Brian Griffin. So the other, the other pick, what one team on the three left? Which one do you want? Yeah, those are both great I bet picks. It's Viking. <laughs> All right, uh, Vikings. One you want? Well, it's not going to be yet. It's going to be team number twenty one oh two. Team Paradox twenty one oh two, twenty seven seventeen and O oh, in official play this year. No blue banners uh, for Team Paradox. And we'll see how the bidding starts there. Twenty eight dollars. For instant regret, looking to take the final. $29 for PNW. Brian Griffins has the optioned out bid here. Let's see if they do it. $30 for Brian Griffins. PNW up to $31. Will this be the last one for these teams? Uh, out in the semis at Del Mar, Utah Regional out in the semis, car division out in the quarters, and then played a couple off seasons as well. Up to $34 for Brian Griffins. <clears throat> Brian Griffins again, a little desperate here with only three teams. Two seconds, one sold to the Brian Griffin. So twelve dollars left in this draft. So it'll be so we have what two teams left? Instant regret has twenty eight dollars. PNW forty one dollars. Somebody's gonna be leaving money on the table here. Let's see who it's gonna be. Uh, of course, two teams left, which means it's either gonna be Viking or Robotic Eagles, and it's gonna be Robotic Eagles fifty five oh seven is the second to last team up on here 5507 there's their bot out of san francisco 14 12 and 1 and let's see how the bidding works out instant bids 14 dollars for lathe will we see a higher bid out of instant or pnw power 15 dollars instant regret should probably bid it high enough that at least pnw can't get both <laughs> <laughs> i mean i was thinking that too but you never know so uh, $16 once, twice sold. Instant regret for $16. Well, I'm going to assume that PNW is going to take uh, the last one. Uh, and probably, I'm guessing, well, for whatever amount they determine, but we'll let that go. Viking Robotics is the last team. 29, 28, 38, 25, and 0. Uh, PNW can, I guess, skew it however you want. We'll skew it low. Appreciate that. $14. Uh, ties to low bid. Could be a good value pickup, though, for the pick and draft. <laughs> Up to 41. Which one are we doing here? I'll let you pick, PNW. Can we go 14? You want to do 14? All right. Yeah. All right, we'll do 14 uh, for them. So it'll be a good value for the pick and draft uh, with that. And with that said, that will conclude all of our teams. Let's do a quick rundown. We'll start uh, on our left side. Uh, with $12 remaining in four teams, Brian Griffins, 498, 973, 1197, 2102. Only four teams in this draft. Do you think you got enough to take it? It's an okay uh, group, but, oh, well, it is what it is. All right. Not a ton of confidence coming out of Brian Griffins, the returning champion from IRI. We'll see uh, how they do. Uh, Eloquence, $12 left. He had team one, teams 114, 696, 1678, 1710, 5818, and 5940. Uh, yeah, I missed uh, 2557 uh, because they were being drafted right after I picked 114, so they went for way too low. Um, but uh, otherwise, uh, I'm feeling, feeling pretty good. I, I could have played the end game a little bit better, uh, but trying to juggle too much all by myself was a little bit too hard but uh yeah i'm feeling pretty good about it so we'll see yeah you're talking about the soda bots who went for 17 dollars a dream team right yeah that was much lower than they should have gone for yeah uh hokey bros spent all your money super early not a whole last change for you but 971 60 19 18 68 50 26 only four teams uh two other teams have four is are these four going to make uh the winning uh set for you uh, I think they will. I think 9 to 1 and 16 9 are two of the best scores. They both got compatible climbs. Um, and then 18 68 and 26 again will be like an attractive second place due to their ability to climb and uh, climb um, and also play uh, confident defense. All right. And chat, by the way, let us know in chat who you think had the best draft out of everybody as well. 
Uh, next up uh, is going to be Instant Regret. Twelve dollars left has six forty nine, eight forty six, twenty forty six, thirty two eighteen, and fifty five oh seven. This is fine. All right, fire burning in the background. Everything's all good. Uh, Lathe is studying. Fourteen dollars left. Only four teams. Some big ones though. Two fifty four, nineteen eighty three, twenty six fifty nine, and sixty four forty three. All in all, I feel pretty good about this draft. I, in pure hindsight, I I wish I, I perhaps wish I had gotten just maybe one more team, but I feel very good about this lineup. Especially, I feel great about two fifty four, nineteen eighty three, and sixty four forty three. I guess I perhaps consider twenty six fifty nine the weak link, but I know that they are smart behind the glass, and I think they won't disappoint me. All right, we'll find out with that. Uh, next up, PW Power, twenty-seven dollars left. We have uh, one fifteen, twenty-seven thirty-three, twenty-nine twenty-eight, twenty-nine thirty, fifty-one ninety-nine, and fifty-seven hundred. Yeah, we uh, probably played a little bit conservative, but we're feeling pretty good about our picks, and um, hopefully, you know, we'll get some good points. This has been a lot of fun. Thanks. Yeah, appreciate appreciate you being on, and uh, always uh, always a pleasure to have people from the PNW up in the. Uh, Representing, or at least people representing PW offer this as well. Uh, Dream Team spent all your money. Uh, 604, 1671, 2557, 2910, and 3476. Some big teams in your uh, lineup there. Yeah, we're ecstatic we got Code Orange for so cheap. I thought for sure it was going to get stolen. Um, I, I agree with Caleb. Uh, Soda Bots was definitely undervalued. That's definitely the steal of the game. I'm super happy about that. And last up, we have Team. Yep. With $13, uh, taking. 972, 1072, 3309, 3647, 4183, and 4414. All in all, I'm pretty happy with it. I uh, got a few big hitters and got a few bargain value menu picks that uh, can hopefully ball out. And just looking at chat, looks like uh, uh, chat saying that they believe that both Eloquence and Yup have the best drafts. Uh, so we'll find out. Uh, once again, uh, for all the teams uh, well, that are currently live on here, we'll have the uh, live draft results. They should be updating it as soon as the first API updates. So it's usually uh, only about a 30 second delay or so. So it'll be very exciting to see. Uh, we will try our best to get the Pick'em list open up tonight. Uh, so teams, thank you uh, everybody uh, for uh, participating in this uh, awesome draft. Prices are set. Uh, we'll make some announcements for that. And uh, if you're watching live in chat, I uh, can't wait to see uh, what you pick for your pick'em list. Of course, I'll be making my own uh, as well, and we'll probably get slaughtered by all of you. But uh, if you're going to be watching Chelsea Champs this weekend, enjoy. Uh, also, make sure you uh, check out the event streaming on fun. Just go to Blue Lions, watch them all, right? Uh, because there are there literally are, I think, eight events uh, this weekend. But uh, if you're watching a couple and you want to make your second one, I would suggest Ozark Mountain Brawl, which will be streamed on fun. Uh, but with that said, everybody, thanks for tuning in. Uh, thanks for checking all this. Uh, and thank you, everybody, who uh, stepped up uh, to support us uh, this afternoon. Just want to real quick read off uh, the ones that I saw. Man, sometimes I feel like our list doesn't catch everybody. But uh, C, uh, C. McBride Connor with 28 months of support. Uh, is this thing where robots beat each other up? Of course it is. Uh, Domicer 930 uh, with five months support. Thank you very much. Hey, it's Leo, 13 months of support. Says, can't wait for this epic event. Matt, 1511, 29 months of support. Holy cow. Make last 18 months of support. Imagine picking teams not from the PNW SMH, yeah. Uh, uh, Elin, uh, 9421, 17 months of support. I'll get your name right one time. Golfer, 4646, 100 bits. And Brian Sachs, 135. Uh, with support as well. So thank you, everybody, uh, for all your support of uh, fun. Definitely appreciate it. Appreciate you keeping us a lot of live independent. Check out our Discord, discord.gg forward slash first updates now. More announcements come soon. But with that said, tomorrow night, check out 148 Robo Wranglers on FRC Deep Dive starting at 8.30 p.m. Eastern. We'll see you next time on fun. Talk to you then. Thanks for watching. If you want more fun content, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos. You can also directly help support fun by visiting our Patreon at patreon.com forward slash first updates now or by subscribing at twitch.tv forward slash first updates now. Thank you to all of our co-executive producers keeping fun loud, live, and independent.